Tonight, police are still looking for the suspect in an afternoon shooting at the Avenues Mall. Police say the shooting happened outside in the parking lot after two men got into a fight. Andrew Badillo spoke with a mall worker who saw the aftermath of the shooting. Around 1.40 this afternoon, Caleb Cook was in line to get food. I saw some guy, he ran in through the front entrance and it didn't click at the time, but he was uh, dripping blood. Cook sent us pictures of the food court, yellow tape blocking off red drops of blood. And he ran further into the dining area. When I saw his face for a brief second, it looked like there was a, a lot of blood. It was then Cook and others in the food court forgot about lunch. When uh, everyone else saw it, they all got up, screamed, ran. Uh, I went back to my store. Yeah, I just waited until things died down. Eventually, Cook made his way outside, joining dozens of shoppers and workers watching police investigate where the victim was shot. And the suspect never re-entered the mall following the shooting, so no other patrons were in danger. The Jacksonville Sheriff's Office says the suspect drove off in a silver SUV. Cook said the mall sent notice to its store saying there was no threat, but he isn't convinced after what he saw at lunch. And I've just thought like, yeah, this is something you hear about pretty often on the news, but being there, seeing it happen, that's a lot different. At the Avenues Mall, Andrew Badillo, First Coast News on your 